favorites video and you all wanted to see the collective haul so I miss the old school collective hauls where you would like kind of just like show a bunch of your purchases from like the month so these are some of the things that I've received or purchased in the last like three weeks we've got clothing we've got makeup skincare and books so we're gonna hit Patreon for exclusive ASMR content. The first store that we're gonna start with is Alara. Alara, Alara, Alara. So, Alara makes some of the most comfortable and cozy loungewear and athletic wear.
I bought, you know me, that's my kryptonite. So I bought not one, not two, but three lip products. The second one I got, kind of in the same exact vein as the Summer Fridays one.
supposed to be like a brow gel and like laminator effect in one I don't know, it just looked really nice, all the photos This is what the packaging looks like It looks white
I was a soulless, unlovable bastard bred into a killer. Oh. <gasps> Detective Evangelina Cruz was mine to taint, use, and ruin. Oh, she's a cop and he's like a murderer. Wait a minute. Oh, shit. Okay, wait, that's piquing my interest. I think it's a dark romance, not a mafia. I don't know. Either way, I got that. <laughs> the book also came with this super cute annotation guide and matching tabs, which is like so adorable. I need these for like every single book. Touch her and die, swoon, plot twist, red flags, to ignore, shit that's hot, violence. Okay, I'm into it, I'm into it. If you know me, then you may know that I am obsessed with Elsie Silver and her Chestnut Springs romance series. The Chestnut Springs series is actually a spin-off series from another series that she wrote first, and so now that I've finished all of the Chestnut Springs books, I decided that I was going to order the entire, entire series. So, this is the, what is it called? Gold Rush Ranch series. There's four books, and um, I believe these are getting so they're gonna have new covers and everything and I wanted to get my hands on the self-published indie editions before they go out of print so I just picked up all four I know I love Elsie's writing she's one of my new favorite romance authors that I found this year and I've already read the first book which is this one this is off to the races As you might be able to guess, this is also a small town Canadian romance series. This first book follows Billy and Vaughn, and she gets hired to be a horse trainer at the ranch that he works at. He's like a really wealthy business man. But yeah, if you want to see how I felt about this, stay tuned for my December reading wrap up. As for these three, I have not read them yet, and I have no idea what they're about, but the second book is a photo finish, and I do believe this follows Violet, who is the sister of the Eaton brothers, who are the main characters of Just Not 
in the 